The purpose of this recording is to show how to make a cross tabulation and a bar chart from a column of data which contains some sort of a qualitative variable such as good, very good, excellent, meal price. So we're going to use the quality rating as a category and rank it, group them together by meal price and then produce a bar chart. We will use Excel's pivot table function. So you see first of all under the data we've got good, very good, excellent, different categories and a meal price. How can we break them down? Using Excel's pivot table function press insert and then pivot table check the data is correct A1 is in the top left C301 is down on the bottom right so it goes from the top left to the bottom right of the data let's put it on a new worksheet so it's clear click OK and the pivot table dialog appears here we want to have rows columns and values into the rows drag quality rating and you can see on the left some sort of a structure is beginning to appear excellent good and very good we want columns with the meal price drag meal price down to column labels again some sort of a format is appearing restaurant drag that down to values again you can see some structure but it's not right yet we want instead to change to account instead of just a sum so on the corner of sum of restaurant click on that and you'll see value field settings appear press on that change sum to count OK. Now we can see a structure appearing. Now you can close the pivot table dialog. We don't need that anymore. So we have quality rating, excellent, good, very good, and meal price across the top. It seems to me that excellent should be in a different place it should be lower down so right click on that and it says move down to move and then it says move excellent to end so now we see we have 300 total observations there were 300 remember it went from C1 to C301 meal price 10 to 19, 20 to 19, etc. with the number of restaurants which fitted into categories good, very good or excellent. So this is a cross tabulation sometimes also called a contingency table. Let us now divide this up into a bar chart. So highlight the area in the middle, never mind the totals we just want good, very good and excellent. And the prices, go back to insert, column, 2D column, and we can see that we have an attractive looking bar chart here with good, very good and excellent along the bottom, the three categories that we had and the price is linked here. We can make it more fancy with titles etc if we wish but this just shows the basic structure of the data and we could see that if restaurants are categorized very good mostly the price is between 20 and 29 etc. Thank you.